Hyundai Ionic Electric. Amazingly, the Hyundai Ionic Electric is now available on the market for direct purchase. For its debut price of $30,000, the features of this car are downright phenomenal. It might be the cheapest on the list, but with its sleek, modern appearance and more than adequate capabilities, it's a far more inexpensive and accessible model for interested buyers. The Hyundai Ionic Sedan now comes in a fully electric plug-in counterpart. The Hyundai Ionic Electric can cover up to 170 miles from a single charge. However, Hyundai has stated that the Ionic will become its sub-brand with at least three other electric vehicles planned for introduction this year, including a mid-size crossover, a sedan, and a large SUV. Kia Niro EV Kia Niro EV is an all-electric, good-looking crossover with a plethora of niceties at reasonable pricing. The Niro EV is built on the Niro Hybrid and retains its design and capabilities. EV comes with many standard features like DC fast charging capability, driver assistance suite, and steering wheel paddle control regenerative braking. The subcompact crossover may refer to a taller hatchback perfectly fit for buyers who want an affordable vehicle with tons of luxury features. This environment friendly vehicle was introduced in 2019 and is now expected to have some updates in the next model. The Nero provides 201 horsepower output and 291 pound-feet of torque from a single electric motor that is powered by a 64 kilowatts per hour battery capacity. The EPA estimated driving range comes out to be 239 miles over a single charge. The powertrain helps propel the vehicle from 0 to 60 miles per hour within 6.5 seconds. Nero's battery can be charged using either a 120 or 240 volt connection. The 240 volt connection takes almost 9 hours to fully charge the vehicle, but some people want fast charging, so Nero also offers a standard DC fast charging option with a 100 kilowatt connection, which can recharge 80% battery within an hour. The only front wheel drive option is available in all Nero's models. The well equipped interior has heated and ventilated front seats, a power sunroof, a 7 inch digital driver display, a 2 zone automatic climate control system, and wireless charging. Nero exhibits all of Kia's driver assistance technology, including standard adaptive cruise control, automated emergency braking, lane departure warning forward collision warning, and lane keeping assist. The base EX trim has a starting price of $40,265. Hyundai Kona Electric Hyundai Kona Electric is a subcompact that offers sprightly driving dynamics and smooth highway rides. A heavy battery pack of 64 kilowatts per hour mounted on the floor provides power to the 201 HP electric motor. The Kona electric motor with a front-wheel drive configuration can accelerate from 0 to 60 miles per hour within 6.4 seconds. Over a single charge, the battery pack is capable of providing 258 miles of driving range. True one-pedal driving is made possible by the aggressive regenerative braking that extends the driving range to the claimed value. The vehicle's interior is quite comfortable and almost similar to its gas counterpart. DC fast charging stations and 110 volt outlets can charge Kona Electric, but a 240 volt outlet is the preferred option. 2022 redesigned Kona Electric features new wheel designs, new front and rear bumpers, and an improved interior that comes with a 10.3 inch infotainment touchscreen and a 10.3 inch reconfigurable digital gauge display. Although Kona is feature rich, the convenience package adds some more desirable features like heated front seats, a sunroof, and a wireless smartphone charging pad. Hyundai has recently added a 3 years or 36,000 mile complimentary scheduled maintenance package. The base SEL trim has a starting price of $39,000. Kia Soul EV This is one eye-catching, boxy, fun car. It comes with a 201 horsepower electric motor with 395 Nm of torque, sending power to the front wheels. 
Powering the Kia Soul EV is a large battery pack of 64 kilowatt hours that offers up to 243 miles of driving range on a full charge. Plugging it into a 100 kilowatt DC charger will recharge the battery to 80% in less than an hour. The Soul EV can speed quietly from 0 to 60 miles per hour in just 7.6 seconds, going on to reach a top speed of 104 miles per hour. Officially, this electric vehicle claims up to 280 miles of range from a single charge, but between 230 and 240 miles is what you might expect. The Kia Soul EV has a starting price of $20,350. Hyundai Ioniq 5 Hyundai has launched a mid-size 5-passenger electric SUV. The Ioniq is a sub-brand of Hyundai, which promised to launch newer EVs soon. This fully electric crossover is going to join the existing EV lineup of Hyundai next year. Ioniq 5 is filled with advanced features, modernized technology, and versatile design. The 800-volt electric motor with RWD technology can generate an output of 215 horsepower, and with AWD it can make 315 horsepower. The former combination takes 7.4 seconds to accelerate the vehicle from 0 to 60 miles per hour, while the latter takes 5.2 seconds only. Ionic 5 will be available with two battery options, a standard 58 kilowatts per hour battery pack, and a long-ranged 77 kilowatts per hour pack. With a 77 kilowatts per hour battery pack, the driving range of Ionic 5 lies between 258 and 290 miles on a single charge. The spacious cabin has a modernized dashboard having a pair of 12-inch digital displays and other useful features like an augmented reality head-up display, a reclining front seat, pop-up footrests, a flat floor, and large cargo space. Hyundai calls its interior an open-air living space. It has a movable and adjustable center console. The rear wheel drive configuration provides a longer range but an all wheel drive configuration is good to have a better grip in cold weather states. It also features Hyundai SmartSense technology with driver assist technology for safety purposes. The base SE trim has an expected starting price of about $45,000 in the US. Kia EV6 the Kia EV6 is designed to be rear or an all-wheel drive. It is also available with either a single electric motor positioned on the rear axle or an electric motor mounted on both axles. The all-wheel drive models have a higher battery and either 313 or 576 total horsepower. The base rear drive model has a lesser battery and only 167 horsepower. Choosing the larger battery increases the total system output of the rear drive EV6 to 218 horsepower. The Kia EV6 is designed in two battery sizes, 58 kilowatt hour and 77.4 kilowatt hour. Kia predicts that the EV6 will have a range of up to 300 miles on a single charge. Kia claims that the battery has an optional voltage of 800 volts and can be charged from 10 to 80% in 18 minutes when plugged into a 350 kilowatt fast charger. This similar system is reported to add 70 miles in just 5 minutes. When connected to a level 2 outlet, the 11 kilowatt onboard charger is well capable for recharging the battery from 10% to 100% in 7 hours. You can enjoy an added space of 28 cubic feet behind the back seat and a total of 54 cubes whenever the back seat backs are pushed down. This EV is good news to potential buyers who anticipate the maximum straight line performance of 0 to 60 miles per hour in 3.5 seconds. The 313 horsepower model will go from 0 to 60 miles per hour in 5.1 seconds. Its price is expected to start around $45,000. Hyundai Ioniq 6 The next Hyundai Ioniq 6 will be significantly influenced by Hyundai's latest prophecy concept. The concept's rear-facing cameras could be replaced with standard wing mirrors. The roofline is expected to increase backseat headroom. This ultra-slim saloon car was designed to be as aerodynamic as possible. Therefore, it featured a simple curving profile, a ground-hugging body, and the bare minimum of intakes and grills. A rear spoiler that can be adjusted automatically helps manage the flow of air over the Prophecy idea. 
The propeller-shaped wheels are designed to keep the brakes cool as you drive. The Hyundai Ioniq 6's interior will feature a clean, minimalist design that emphasizes its spaciousness and gives it a futuristic aspect. There are several similarities between the Ioniq 5 and the Ioniq 6, including a similar low-profile motif. On a white panel with curving corners, small AC vents, temperature control panel, and pedals, we see the same two-spoke steering wheel, grouped digital instrument cluster, and infotainment system panels. One noticeable change is that the Ioniq 6 appears to have a fixed-type central console, unlike the Ioniq 5. Its starting price is $40,000. Genesis EV G80 We do not know much about the G80's electric drivetrain. It will come standard with all-wheel drive and range up to 310 miles according to the worldwide NEDC standard and 265 miles according to the Korean standard. Genesis hasn't officially revealed the battery pack size or power output. Still, it does indicate that normal fast charging will be able to charge the battery pack from 10% to 80% in 22 minutes. With a claimed pace of 4.9 seconds from 0 to 60 miles per hour, the electric vehicle should be faster than the G80's base 2.5 liter 4 cylinder engine, if not as quick as the optional twin turbo 3.5 liter V6. The dashboard appears to be the same attractive design as the gas vehicle. However, Genesis claims to have used many recycled materials. The company has also opted for an appearance virtually indistinguishable from the normal G80, rather than the futuristic exterior and interior design accents seen on rival electric luxury sedans, such as the Audi e-tron GT and Mercedes EQS. The vehicle promises to feature safety and driver assistance, warranty, and maintenance coverage. We await more information from Genesis on the interior, infotainment, and connectivity. The starting price is $60,000. Hyundai Ioniq 7 The Ioniq 7 will be built on Hyundai eGMP Kia's scalable platform for electric cars, with the width and wheelbase length of the modular architecture left relatively open. With fewer restrictions on these characteristics, the size of the battery that the giant SUV must accommodate will be a significant deciding factor. The Hyundai Ioniq 7 will include a premium three-row cabin with automatic climate control, keyless entry, parking sensors, and a multifunctional steering wheel. It should consist of a touchscreen infotainment system with OTA updates and linked car capabilities. Multiple airbags, ABS with EBD, and automated driving assistance systems are expected to be available to ensure passenger safety. This vehicle will be based on the eGMP scalable platform with a long hood, wide rectangular grille, full width DRL, and parametric pixel LED headlights. Blacked out B pillars, flush fitted door handles, and stylish wheels will surround it. The configuration for the rear lights will be similar to the frontal lights. The SUV's wheelbase will be longer than the Ioniq 5. The Hyundai Ioniq 7's price and availability will be published at the time of its introduction. It would cost about $50,000. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to check out these videos shown on your screen right now.